Everyone, thank you so much for joining us for another episode of the NetOps Expert. Today, I'm joined by Matt Johnson, and he is the head of customer support for our Agile Operations Division. Today, our subject is a great topic on how to get to the latest version of DX NetOps 21.2 and the new programs that have been devised by our support organization to make sure you are successful in those upgrades to the latest version. So Matt, thank you so much for joining us today. Yeah, thanks, great to be here. All right, Matt, so first question for you is, uh, can you tell us a little bit about the DX NetOps weekend upgrade program and why customers should be interested in it? Yeah, absolutely. Um, so as we, we've experienced over the years, IT environments vary in size and complexity and the speed at which things are changing in, in the IT industry, it's, it's critical that we stay frequent on, on our software um, to ensure that we're mitigating risk against all of the latest threats as well as getting uh, resolutions to defects that may have been discovered and most importantly getting the advantages of, of the feature functionality that's delivered with our latest releases. And in, in the support organization, we're often that team that is there to react to a problem you may encounter during that event. Uh, and what we'd like to do is, is better partner with you to ensure that you, you don't have those issues that you could potentially encounter and ultimately you're successful with your upgrade. Uh, that's what it's all about and why I think it, it's a great opportunity for us to partner. Yeah, it just sounds like um, such a good program uh, that your team and the broader team has developed. And uh, I know a lot of our customers have uh, taken advantage of it, but we definitely want to get more of our customers uh, involved in this weekend program as well. So uh, you mentioned, uh, you know, today's environments are very complex. What does the Broadcom support team bring to the table to help navigate that complexity? Yeah, so because we work with hundreds of customers across the globe, we've had the opportunity to, to really understand the, the variations of, of the complexities in those environments. And in having that experience, not only with Broadcom software, but also with the software and hardware that complements our software that our software interacts with, it gives us an advantage of uh, experience and understanding what the problems are that, that customers encounter. Uh, both in, in production operations, but also in this event of upgrading their software in production. Um, so it really gives us, allows us to bring that experience in a much more uh, calm and controlled situation, rather than a reactive, everything's down, we've got to get it back up moment, but rather preparation and reviewing what needs to happen and, and helping ensure that it's successful when we do go into that event. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, and I know, uh, uh, as I lead into this next question, um, I actually spoke with a customer today and they specifically asked, um, and you're going to answer this now, how um, how do they, how does Broadcom help them get prepped for the weekend? So my question is, is how, how does Broadcom support and the weekend upgrade program help the customers prepare for a successful upgrade? Yeah, so especially given the significance um, of, of an upgrade event itself, the, the, you know, the most important thing to do is plan. Um, and in our experience, the, the level of, of detail uh, and preparation has varied across the, the spectrum. Uh, so our intent is really to engage early uh, and as early as possible prior to the, the dedicated weekend for the upgrade itself and walk through that plan. And if there's not a plan well vetted out or, uh, or prepared for, then help you actually materialize and, and prepare that plan. Uh, and in going through that with our support experts to prepare for all the steps that need to be taken, that you have all the proper resources allocated, uh, that you've taken the, the proper mitigation steps with the interacting software and hardware, and then ultimately being able to execute in a very effective and efficient way. I, uh, I know after speaking to this customer today, um, they're excited about the program, but they definitely wanted to understand um, how they can best get prepared um, to be successful. And uh, you explained really well how, um, how we help our customers do that. So thank you. Yeah, and one more just benefit that I wanted to, to throw in there um, is it, it allows actually the support team to become more educated in your environment as well um, because when there is a problem inevitably there will be a problem in 
at some step, um, you know, our goal is just to mitigate all of them. But if there is one, our engineers are now pre-educated on what your plan is, what your environment is. And ultimately that leads to a much faster uh, resolution to those That's issues true. and ensures we stay on track. So there's there's definitely an out, uh, a benefit to that as well. That makes sense. Yep. So is this limited to only certain customers or customers with only parts of the NetOps platform? No, actually we're here to support all of our customers. So, you know, our goal is everybody that's that's made the decision to invest in DX NetOps, you know, one or all of the components. Um, we're here to help you get uh, to and stay on the most current versions of our software. Um, so, you know, while they're only available for production upgrades, uh, it's for all customers. And, and if you are preparing a non-production upgrade, we're happy to help with that as well. And we can get engaged during normal business hours to review your plans for those upgrades and then set, us up, set ourselves up to partner for when you're ready to do that production upgrade uh, during one of our future upgrade weekends. Got it. So I know we've been asked this before and it's a great question. Um, when it comes to the upgrade itself, um, does support actually help with the upgrade? Upgrade? How do they? How do they get assistance? Yep. So support doesn't actually perform any steps of the upgrade itself. Um, if if you don't have uh, the skill set or the staff available to perform the upgrade yourself, while we'll help you in the planning process, um, we do have um, services offerings that definitely can be advantageous, and then we'll work alongside whoever your partner is from a services perspective in the same fashion as if you were performing the upgrade yourself. Um, but when it comes to the weekend, support will be there, um, not only to respond to any severity issue you decide to raise um, during the upgrade itself related to that upgrade, um, but we'll also check in periodically on a proactive basis to your dial-in, whether it be a WebEx, a Zoom, just to ensure that you're on track and if you have any questions, rather than just waiting for a reactive type situation. If I'm a customer looking to do the upgrade, um, you're obviously not going to download the files for me. You're not gonna double click the installation files and watch them progress from zero to 100%. But um, with the prep and the pre-interview and, and everything that you do with the customer prior to the upgrade weekend, they should feel confident in, in handling a lot of it because of the support you've given them to get ready for that, that weekend upgrade. Absolutely. And, yeah. and, and actually to continue to, or to uh, reinforce that confidence, uh, we fully staff our support team over the weekend. Traditionally, you typically when upgrades happens or after hours or on weekends, we're usually um, staffed only with a resource that will respond to the production down severity one instance incidents. So uh, in this particular situation or on these dedicated weekends that we'll actually have a full staff. And as I mentioned, uh, respond to any severity case that you raise related to this, to this, uh, to this event. So we're prepared to, to respond and help you throughout that plan that we've reviewed. So, you know, not only can I feel comfortable with performing the upgrade um, and make sure all the steps are, are entail uh, that I know I need to execute once that upgrade weekend happens, but if I run into any issues, I don't, I don't, I won't expect to wait five, six hours for somebody to get back to me. You're saying, you know, you, your support team is waiting for any issues that arrive and boom, you're there when I need you. That's right. That's right. Um, yep. And probably more, <laughs> more often than not, at least in the experiences during these weekends that we've hosted so far, um, you'll probably experience a faster turnaround time because our, our staffing is focused specifically on upgrades for that particular weekend. So we're not, in, in addition to those cases, managing other uh, cases that may come in at the same time as well. So you probably get even a more focused uh, support attention during that time frame. So you know what, that's a perfect segue into our next uh, question, which is um, what are some of the lessons learned that you and your team have received and, and gotten through this program and uh, any customer feedback that you've received as well? Yeah, um, so it, it's, it's a new program. Uh, this is not something that we have traditionally done uh, either as part of uh, CA or, or Broadcom. Uh, so there's definitely learning opportunities with regards to preparation and um, responding to our customers during the weekend. 
but it's been very positive through the couple of weekends that we've executed up to this point. Um, and it's been very positive from a customer experience perspective. Uh, we've, we've had very few set ones associated to these events, but when they have occurred, as I mentioned uh, earlier, we were educated and aware of, of what these environments look like. So we were very quick to be able to mitigate and solve those issues and keep the upgrade moving forward. Uh, up to this point, we've had 100% success in the upgrades that we've assisted, which is a very important outcome that we're trying to achieve is get uh, everybody successfully upgraded during their outage window because you've committed a lot of resources during that time frame. So it's important to, to achieve that outcome objective. Um, so we're very excited about it. And I think our customers have been very pleasantly surprised about what the opportunity is um, to, to partner on, on this event. Last but not least, um, how do our customers sign up for it? Yeah, um, it's, right now the best way to, to engage us is to open up a support case. Uh, our support team is uh, fully aware and understanding of what our goals are around this program. And so they're excited to, to learn about when you're, you're planning to upgrade. And if you're not sure when you're gonna upgrade, uh, engage our team because they can help you understand when our next upgrade event is gonna happen. Uh, so you can coordinate around planning your production upgrade to that that particular weekend. Um, and again, if, if it doesn't coordinate with that, let us work with you and figure out how we might be able to, to manage that accordingly. And in, in, in any event, still review your plans so that you have a higher rate of success in, in getting your upgrade. Um, you can also reach out to your account team. Um, they're gonna be happy to, to engage with you and, and gather the information and put you in contact with our support team so that we can start partnering and preparing for your upgrade. All right, Matt, uh, I wanna thank you again for joining us today. Um, I thank you, everyone out there, for uh, listening to our latest release of the NetOps Expert and stay tuned for our next episode, which is gonna be about the recent announcement on Broadcom's intent to acquire AppNeta. So thank you all so much. Thanks.